Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Discord.js Boss Series. This is the sixth episode of today's video. Well, this is a highly requested video uh, by you guys in my Discord server and my comments. Uh, one of you guys told me that you should probably make a video about how to make a um, when a member joins the Discord server, welcome message, show up, or some stuff like this. And I said, oh, why not? Let's just make the sixth episode about this. All right, guys, let's get into the video. Before we start the video, also. Make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and follow me in the socials. Also, you can follow me on Twitter, you can follow me in the Twitch because I'm most of the time streaming there. And you can also join to our Discord server. Before we start the video, actually, I want you guys to let you know about something. We got our first sponsorship for today's video. And guess what it is? It's a Discord bot creator. If you don't know what is a Discord bot, well, you probably know what is a Discord bot. But if you don't want to kill yourself with coding a lot and, you know, a lot of coding or programming or some stuff like this, you just need to um, go to the Steam and then download this application. This application is very, very awesome. They got me a very a copy of the application. And I literally used it and it was pretty nice like literally if you're not uh, don't want to use um, coding no, no, you know what I mean Python or JS or some stuff like this you just need to program it using the node models but how it's worked is pretty simple if you guys go to your steam and then pay it's just it's just not a lot of money you just need to pay like $11 and you will get the application well this application is pretty neat I just actually used it, but literally this application is the best application on this team for making a discord bot I reviewed a lot more on this team but literally those are actually don't have the thing that like you can't host it 24 7 but using this application you just can uh, you create the bot and the cool thing about this you can access to the source code which is so cool well this is how it works if you just go to this setup uh, you can set up your bot actually in there as you can see your bot prefix the client ID as you can see, you can set the commands. If you guys want interested on this application, just click in the description and go to the Steam. Use the application pretty much. It's just $11. It's not pretty much too much actually. So it's, it's pretty neat. It's lifetime. So yeah. All right, let's get into the video. I talked a lot, you know. All right, let's get into the video. Basically, all you guys need to do is just uh, pretty simple. If you go to the index.js, you will see a lot of those, you know, pretty much in here. I want you guys to uh, go to your uh, index.js and as you can see we have um as you know we made an event handler in here but basically i'm not going to use this event handler for today's video i was going to actually use this command handler for today's video for the function of the because you know uh, uh on member let me just show you we're going to use the guild member.add and the thing is why we're using this because um guild member.add is the welcome message that's going to occur when we are going to invite someone to discord or some stuff like this pretty simple you just need to add an event but i was going to add this within my event handler but basically uh, this, this command handler i mean uh, event handler wasn't be able to recognize this event so i said oh my goodness this is so bad and i thought okay if that's gonna happen it's fine you just need to go to your index address and add this event basically just need to bot that on the event event name is guild member or add member and it's gonna do a const welcome message this is gonna connect to our welcome channel so what is a welcome channel the welcome channel is a channel that the welcome is gonna show up so let's just say i have a welcome message in here as you can see i'm gonna name rename this to let's just say welcome whatever you want call it the channel name now i just have to copy the name and i just have to go to const my welcome message guild member dot guild dot channels dot catch dot find channel uh, this is string here the channel the name equal equal to welcome so i'm just gonna put a welcome right over here there we go each time you change your channel name you just need to rename this area and then i'm gonna do a message like welcome uh let's just say welcome uh welcome channel it's gonna connect to this welcome channel right over here and it's gonna send the message into this welcome channel so this mean so this means that it's going to connect to the welcome channel and it's going to send the message. So I'm just going to do a welcome and the member name. So each time the member joins the server, it's going to do a welcome, the member name. You can make it customized. You can make it an embed from it. You just need to have to remember this tag right over here. It's going to mention the user. So just make sure you add this one to your code if you want to mention the user while he's joining the server. That's it. Basically, that's all. Uh, oh, I know it wasn't a long video because basically that was the easiest video ever. Also, 
uh, the leave message. It exactly works the same as this. You just need to do bot.on and you have to do um, guild member remove. And it's gonna uh, do something like this member. And we're gonna do an arrow function. And then we need to do this. There we go. Basically, just need to copy this one here and then literally put this one and just type goodbye. So I'm just gonna make a goodbye channel as well. So we will probably be able to all of the logs. So just do a goodbye. Make sure your channel have permissions as well to send the messages into here. Let's put the will goodbye here and there we go. And basically that's it. That's all you need to do. Uh, let's just do a new terminal and let's just test if it's gonna work. It should work for sure. Just don't worry about that. I think I somehow reason. I think I, uh, if Right, hold on a second. Let me just make sure about something real quick. Let me just go to Visual Studio Code one more time because uh, accidentally I closed the terminal without executing the command. Let me just do the VS Code again. Here we go. Let's open the Visual Studio Code one more time. And there we go. Hello? What is this? No, goodbye. Alright, let's just go here. Uh, let's just uh, check the terminal right now. You should save your file and then you should do a uh, node dot on There we go No dot is gonna say your bot is online. Yeah, there we go test test that chef is online Basically all you guys need to do is just go to your second alt account or whatever you want to call it and just leave the server If I leave the server right now, it's gonna say goodbye goodbye as you can see, literally worked fine without any problems. I uh, just have to copy the code here and we just turn to my Discord server. Test Discord server, there we go. Goodbye, as you can see, it says goodbye and it says welcome. Basically, that's it. It's gonna say the welcome message and pretty simple, straightforward. You can customize it actually. You can put any message you want and also you can make the embed from this. You just need to be creative. That's all you need to do. And yeah, that was it for today's video, basically. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, follow me on the socials. If you want to see more episodes as well, just make sure to support me by following the Twitch and also subscribe to the channel. Also, check the link in the description for the Discord bot studio if you don't want to even code for your bot. Um, well, you just need to do, you, know, you just need to pay this application, then you will be able to get the application without any problems. And thank you, thank you Discord Bot Studio for sponsoring today's video. And I hope you guys see you in the next video. See you guys, peace out, join to Discord if you have any problems. Peace out everyone.